Hey everybody, so this is part two of my diluted earnings per share series. So in uh, this video, we're going to talk about warrants. So what exactly are warrants? Well, uh, warrants are very similar to stock options because they grant you the right to uh, purchase the actual shares in a future date. So we saw this a lot with uh, SPACs. So if you guys don't know what a SPAC is, it's a special acquisition company where, um, you know, venture capitalists, they're essentially just uh, creating a shell company. They're listing it on the exchange and they're uh, collecting funds so that they could go purchase a stake in another company. And then these two companies merge together and then they take the private company public. So um, let's talk about Open Door, for example. So Open Door was uh, led by Chamath where essentially Chamath, he got this, um, he got the shell company, he called it IPOB. So IPOB um, gathered all of these funds and then with those funds, he went and he purchased a stake in Open Door and took it public through IPOB. So IPOB had its ticker um, symbol changed to open. So this is essentially what happened. This is how this company went public. But before this, we had something called IPOBW. So IPOBW was essentially just the warrants. So, um, you know, these were trading at a really low price. It, I remember it being about like two, $2, $4 or something along those lines. So let's just say that IPOBW cost uh, $4. Now, let me go ahead and show you something. So just like stock options, you know, warrants, it costs money to exercise them. So it says right here, let me zoom in. It says each whole warrant entitled the holder thereof to purchase one class A ordinary share for $11.50 per share subject to adjustment. So right there, they basically told us the exercise price is $11.50 and your IPOBW turns into open door. So you can essentially trade one IPOB warrant for one share of open door. So if the exercise price is $11.50, then that means that your actual share price is uh, $15.50. Now, let's say in a future date after the merger, Open Door is trading at $20. So if Open Door is trading at $20, it makes sense for you to exercise your warrants and your share basis will just basically be $15.50. So that means you're making $4.50 when you exercise the warrants and you sell the shares directly. But what happens if Opendoor is trading at $10? Well, if Opendoor is trading at $10, why would you exercise those warrants? It doesn't make sense. So the whole idea of the warrants is that it's giving you exposure, but it's not um, that risky. So let's say I just bought 100 um, 100 warrants. Let's say I bought 100 warrants and that cost me $400. Now, let's say that open door, it doesn't pan out that well. And uh, let's say that the um, shares go down to like $8 or $7 or $5, $1 or whatever. Then, you know, my loss is only $400 because that's all I invested. Now, let's say that open door, it goes to $50. Well, then I have the option to exercise those warrants and I make a ton of money with just a little bit of exposure. So that is the whole purpose of the warrants. So for example, if open door price is only $6, you know, it doesn't make sense for me to exercise because my exercise price is $11.50. It said it right here. So um, each whole warrant entitles the shareholder thereof to purchase one class A ordinary share for $11.50 per share. So why would I exercise that warrant if the share price is currently at $6? Well, 
So if that's the case, the warrants are not dilutive. Now, if Open Door is over $11.50, there is reasonable assumption that you will exercise those warrants because it is above the exercise price. So in that case, it is dilutive and it adds to the denominator. So let's say that there's a 1 million warrants outstanding. Then that means 1 million shares are added to the denominator when you're calculating diluted earnings per share. Now, one more thing with warrants. So when it comes to warrants, a company can redeem them. So they can essentially just get rid of all of the warrants. And we see that right here. So this article is um, from June 9th, 2021. It says open door technologies to redeem all outstanding warrants. So it says that they're going to redeem the warrants for uh, 10 cents per warrant. So either you get rid of it or you get 10 cents or you exercise and you buy the shares with that um, $11.50 exercise price. So I hope this kind of explained what warrants are and how it could be dilutive. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and stay tuned for the third and final part where I talk about convertible notes and bonds.